Come have fun with us and don't forget to subscribe. What's up, everybody? I'm Rick. Hey, Mana. And welcome to our reaction to Naruto Shippuden episode 489. Welcome. Naruto slash Naruto Shippuden. It's your first time watching it. Yeah. And it's one of the anime on our bucket list of 101 anime we want to finish in our lifetime. On this channel, the goal is to complete all of them. Yes. Last time we finished uh, that uh, Sasuke story, you know, mm -hmm. adapted from the novel. Um, and it was pretty good. Yeah, I really enjoyed that story. I thought mm -hmm. it was a good story. Yeah. Um, we talked about, you know, our general feelings last time, but we can, you know, talk yeah. about it a bit more here. Um, you know, one thing that I really appreciated also was it's focused. Yeah. You know? We stay with Sasuke. You know, mm -hmm. it would have been easy to do what they often do in these, you know, side stories uh, and uh, often in the fillers, they do that too. Which is, let's find a way to plug Naruto into this. Yeah, they do that a lot. And mm -hmm. I like because you can feel Naruto's influence in it. Even with like, I, I didn't always comment because, you know, I was watching. But even as you see Sasuke doing or saying some things, like there are some small elements there that you think like, oh, that's because of what happened with, with, with the Naruto. Naruto. Mm -hmm. You know, he wouldn't have done that before. He wouldn't have said that before. And I I like that you feel Naruto's influence, but you don't need to like put it like out there in your face, you know, mm -hmm. like every time there's something, oh, here's a flashback. Every time there's a comment, oh, here's a flashback with Naruto. Yeah. Or even worse, like to have Naruto actually be there. Yeah, yeah. come jump into it. Yeah. Save the day. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, I like how they resolve everything, right? Yeah. Uh, there was no killing of the... Uh, antagonist yeah. or anything like that right they talk through it and he convinces her that you know there's other paths out there you have people with you you're not alone i like that uh, they still continued this idea of you know the, the the power whatever connecting people or bringing people together because if you think about it you know naruto helps sasuke see a better way and then in return sasuke went out there and helped someone else in the same way mm -hmm. right yeah it really feels like like they are bond now not just by uh you know the sorrow or by having similar terrible fates but also by giving giving hope paying forward and uh it's also you know nice to realize in what way um the world that was envisioned by, uh, you know, a lot of them when talking about stopping the cycle of hatred could be, you know, brought upon. Yeah. Not in its entirety, but like one step forward, which is that by helping people mm. and by cutting that cycle, you know, one at a time, one person at a time, you convince that person to then act like that and they will then convince someone else right yeah, for exactly. example uh naruto convinces sasuke that like hatred is not the solution you have to stop that here and then sasuke convinces uh her the uh, antagonist like yeah. you know that hatred is not the solution you know right and then she she might in return might... go out there and help someone else in the same way yeah. exactly and so it's these little things that in the end, will have a bigger impact, right. right? Nothing can be perfect, but this helps. Also, I like the idea, you know, when you put it that way, that it can't really truly be done by one person. Like, mm. Naruto did have a huge impact in that he maybe represents um, a model to follow for a lot of people, but he himself is not the one helping everyone mm -hmm. right but rather by sharing his vision with the people close to him they can then you know go and spread it further and further it's like from one person to the next and in that way it's not really naruto who helps everyone but rather people just help each other mm -hmm. right yes naruto jesus indeed <laughs> let us now move on to this episode and see what it brings. No, he knows exactly. Hmm. Yeah, 
Also, you ask so many questions. I like that we see the evolution of the the dress code, you know, the things they wear. Ah, uh, yeah. Not just individually, but you see the, the vest is different now. Mm -mm. See a lot of them with this red, red uh, band. Yeah, I I was gonna say this kid talks like, you know, he's never seen <laughs> a world at war. Yeah, but I mean, it wasn't that long ago. I, or maybe he was a kid back when it was the war was going on. No, this if this is still some years later. He wasn't the infinite Tsukiyomi that kid. Yeah, he was in caught in it, but maybe he wasn't like at war, mm. like at, on the battlefield. But yeah, I I was thinking, you know, like. The, the difference, right, between someone who's still kind of not knowledgeable of the kind of pain that war brings, and then you have someone like Shikamaru who knows who, way too well. Mm. Yeah, this might be boring, but it's better than the alternative. Yeah, exactly. Oh, there it is two years later. Mm -hmm. Isn't that nice? So. Yeah. Is that his purpose now? Also, I like how Kakashi talks to him now, you know. Mm. It really feels like they're equal. Oh, I just noticed he said he has a six on his. Yeah, on the back of the vest. Yeah. yeah. I guess there is the traditional like outfit of the Okage, but if you think about it, the fourth Okage also was wearing it differently. He would uh, wear he it had, sometimes, though. Yeah, but he had his own. Uh... Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> no, he's not suspicious. <laughs> <Is that good>? yeah. <laughs> I guess that's it, I won. I'm busy now. Oh, training. Oh, that's not that good, huh? See, here for the official yeah, thing, for the he official had the... Yeah, official thing, he has the outfit. Mm. He's a responsible adult with many responsibilities. Mm -hmm. And then you still have to make time for your friends, you know? Yeah. Don't you have a kid in your office? You can mentor him. Yeah. <laughs> That's how adulthood feels. That's too real. <laughs> because now it's by default, everything is a drag. <laughs> I don't need to mention it anymore. Barbecue hopping. Shikamaru, Nanka Kinina There's always something on his mind. Long list of missing wow. person. Mm. 
So this is the paradox of uh, of their world. I their guess. world, yeah, their lives as a ninja, right? Yeah. Because they exist to to, to fight. fight for battles. Uh, yeah. So a world a world at peace means it's not good for them. They have nothing to do. But they don't like war. Yeah, you know? exactly. And they say that they. You know, they all say they strive for peace. Exactly. But like for someone who says, you know, we want peace, that you made war your job. It's... It's because war was the normal state of the world. Yeah. And so, you know, being a ninja became one of the main occupations. Right. But it doesn't mean that you want to keep it that right. way, right? But then from the moment, everybody is... A, oh, not everybody, but a large portion of people are ninja, those villages are ninja village. Yeah. Then when peace comes. Yeah, exactly. And the, what do they do now? The way they make their money is through requests, right? Right. And it's not always about war, it's just general requests. Uh, yeah. You know, the easy one, like find my cats, but sometimes it's, you know, murder these people, protect me from the, those people. Yeah, exactly. Or even just like, you know, transport someone somewhere safely. Yeah, exactly. Like but when there's no danger, yeah. there's no people, money coming in. Yeah. Even for jobs like this, people are less likely to pay, you know, because they mm -hmm. think like, oh, we're at peace. Nothing, yeah. Probably nothing bad will happen. But if there's no money coming in, that's not good for the village. Yeah, exactly. And that will be a cause for war afterwards, yeah. you know. They did talk about that before. Um, yeah. That was, that was one of the issues. Mm -hmm. <laughs> いきなりなんだ。ほらな。質問を質問で返すときは。ああ、she <笑> さあ、最難だったな。手まりは勘のいいやつです。いずれ When speaking of the devil. Right. Oh, that's a long report. Shijimanokunio,伸ばなしにすれば、いずれは連合の脅威となるでしょうが、忍びという哀れの存在、それどころかこの世界の枠組みそのものを変える存在になるかもしれません。Oh, that those are big words. いや。まずいっすね。最後無事かな。簡単に死ぬようなやつじゃありません。ですが、文面から滲み出る言語という男に対する賞賛にも満たし打ち明け。うん。そういうやつ。純粋だからね、彼は。最後救出し、シジマの
<laughs> <laughs> so many. Yeah. Nasuma. Oh. しかまるも忙しい身なんだから毎月来てくれなくてもいいのよ。この人ベビーシッターさん時々未来を見てもらっててね。どうも。こう見えて他家様の右腕なのよ。よろしくください。どうなんですね。What <laughs> <laughs> It's a popular place to move, huh, Kanoa? I guess. She's so cute. Yeah. Oh, they don't make her a shinobi. <laughs> and of course there. He looks so different with the hair like that and now even without the, the thing on. <laughs> of course. Yeah. Half <laughs> of my body is made of that's funny. あ、そうですね。そうですね。いや。分かってる。もう多くの任務をこなして、やっぱりナルトでなければと。<laughs> <laughs> みんなに思わせるためだ。大切なもの。いや、ないんだぜ。はい、はい。お前は他家になる男だ。それを忘れんな。まっすぐ自分の言葉は曲げねえ。それが俺の任務だ。俺たちのだ。ナルト。お前は